Now this video I'm going to show you how to install a theme in Jupyter 8. So the first theme we want to do is find the theme. So we're going to go to Jupyter.org and we're going to make sure we got theme selected and then choose search. After we've done that we want to choose our core compatibility. So we want to choose 8 because we're using Jupyter 8 for this video. Then you, here will be all the themes available for Jupyter 8. So I'm going to choose the Zurb Foundation theme. So the next thing I want to do is just check the requirements for the theme, so we can see them here. So we see the PHP version needs, uh, the jQuery version, and we just got to scroll down. I'm going to choose this Jupyter 8 version because it's the only one available for Jupyter 8 at the moment. So I'm just going to right click, copy the link's address, and then go to where it says appearances, and click on where it says install theme. And here we can enter our theme URL. So I'm just going to put this in here and then click on install. We can see now the theme's installed. We can see now the theme's installed and now we choose install newly added theme. And we can see the theme here. The next thing we do is choose install and set as default. We can see this message now it says uh, Zev Foundation is now our default theme. And we can see it's at the top now. So if we go to the front of our website, we should see the theme. And now we can see our new Jupyter themes installed. So thank you for watching my video. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. And if you want to get more video updates on how to use Jupyter, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have two links below my video. If you click on this link here, it will take you to DigitalOcean's website. I've been using DigitalOcean's hosting for about two years. And it's only like $5 a month to host a Jupyter website on DigitalOcean. It's really cheap and really easy to use. And if you click on this link, uh, Jupyter Shoot Surf, it will take you to my website where I've got plenty more tutorials. You can check these out and I'll truly find them helpful. And also if you have any like suggestions for videos, please leave a comment. I'm always happy to help. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you found it helpful and you have a great week. Take care. Bye.